Here we can see the liver lobule model. Now a lobule refers to a chunk of something. So if you take a chunk of the liver and you blow it up, this is what you would see. Now over here we take a smaller chunk and blow it up to see even more microscopic structures. But on this liver lobule, we have things like the central vein in the middle of each. Here we can see a portal triad where three structures always together, purple, green, red. The purple would be the hepatic portal vein, hepatic portal vein. The red would be the hepatic artery proper. And the green would be a bile duct. Not the same as the other bile duct, but a duct filled with bile traveling out of the liver. Furthermore, these lines here are sinusoids. The sinusoids are best seen if we zoom in to let's say just this area over here. Now we can still see that portal triad, the bile duct, hepatic portal vein, and hepatic artery proper. But now we can see this vein leads into the sinusoids. Sinusoids are like these valleys traveling through the liver to the central vein. My probe would be representing the central vein right now. All these cells are hepatocytes, which produce the bile, among other things. You can also see this green line leading from the hepatocytes out to the bile duct. So as soon as the bile is created, it is taken out through a bile ductule, this small green line, to a bile duct. Furthermore, inside the sinusoids, we can see a Kepner cell. Kepner cell right here. They are star shaped. And that concludes the liver lobule model.